whatever branch of engineering you study, only a software company will recruit you. <laughs> I'll tell you what happens in a campus interview, final year interview. All final year students will be here. All IT companies will be here. They will welcome them. Come guys, come, come, come. Sir, mechanical, ah, it's okay, da, come. <laughs> Sir, chemical, yeah, it ends with engineering, no? <laughs> Get in. They will hire you, irrespective of the background, and they will train you in everything. C, C++, Java, Oracle, .NET, Butterscotch, Vanilla, Strawberry. <laughs> After all the trainings, you will get into a project, there your manager will ask you to work in Excel sheet. <laughs> How do I know? Because I was a software engineer. <laughs> I used to work for this company called Cognizant, CTS. My mother was very proud. Whenever she introduced me to someone, she always says, my son Manoj, software engineer working in CTS office. But the reality is, I am a software engineer working in MS office. <laughs> Without me having to say a single word, you may have realized the significance of Excel. Whether you work in the finance industry or in the software, tools such as Excel will help you to excel in your field. Learning Excel will allow you to save at least two hours of your time. So are you ready to save your time and stand out from others? If yes, let's get started. I am Kartika Ramachandran. I'll be your guide throughout the session. Because you are not going to write any Excel exams, I don't want to spend your time by telling about the history of Excel, how it was developed, who designed it, when it was developed and so on. We are here to learn how to save time. So we can jump right into the session without wasting time. As the first step or a prerequisite before learning Excel, be ready with a laptop or a PC and open a blank Excel sheet and try to do it on your own along with me so that you will be able to understand faster and if you want to write down any notes you can also write them down when you write short notes you will be able to remember everything quickly before you start doing anything you should understand why what and how what is this it means why we should learn excel what all are the things we will learn and how we will learn let's answer the first question why should we learn excel we have already understood one point that is to save time. Other than that, there are many other factors. The first point is the analysis of large volume of data. Imagine you are working in an MNC with a large number of transactions and you are assigned a task that require you to provide a report on those transactions. What would you do? It is impossible to take each transactions and analyze them manually. This Excel will come in handy. It has 16,000 columns and 10 lakhs plus rows. So easily data can be managed and analyzed. Next is efficiency and accuracy in data processing. Computing is always a pain for everyone because when you do it manually, it may not be accurate and will take long time to calculate things. However, Excel will assist us in doing all types of challenging calculations, allowing us to process data with a greater efficiency and precision. Next and most importantly, Excel is an industry accepted software. Nowadays, all businesses specify that candidates shall have Excel know-how in their employment requirements. If you are very familiar with Excel, you will always have an advantage when presenting your CV for any job applications. Your chances of being selected for the position will be very high. And the fourth one is add sophistication to data presentation. This means that in Excel, we can present even complex data in multiple ways such as charts, diagrams and so on so that users can easily comprehend what is going on. The next question we have to answer is what are we going to learn? So if you want to declare that you have learned Excel, what exactly do you need to know to say that yes, I know how to work in Excel? The first is that you should become acquainted with the Excel interface. This means that when you open Excel, you will see several tabs, options, buttons, among other things. So you need to grasp what all of these things are. After that, you must learn how to enter data into these applications and its formatting, styling of the data you have entered. Then you will learn different formulae and functions. And there are many shortcut formulae for complex computations that will make your job easier. In addition, we will learn how to summarize and present data. Now a thought may pop into your mind that Excel is a piece of computing software. Is it used for presentation? Yes, you had it right. People nowadays utilize Excel 
to present and explain statistics in board meeting. Don't worry, we will figure it out. We will learn each and everything detailing. Now it's time for answering the third question. The key issue that I have to address as an instructor is how we will learn Excel. It's a big question though. And let me tell you, I will share a secret method with you that will allow you to learn Excel quickly and effortlessly, including all of the shortcut keys. Excited? Do you want to know the secret? It's fairly simple if you practice. Yes, you must practice. Only then you will be able to recall all of the shortcut keys and make everything work. So we can begin working with Excel. Be ready with your laptop.